Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So as promised today, I'm gonna to be showing you guys my three favorite ways to tie a headscarf. And I thought with Ramadan here, it's probably the perfect time to show you guys, and especially since this is one of the highest requested tutorials that I get. So to start our video, I'm gonna show you guys how to get this turban look over here. So for this first look, you're going to need a large square scarf and you're going to fold it with diagonal points meeting. You're going to have the middle point at the front of your face with the two opposite sides on either shoulder. Using the sides of the scarf on your left and right hand side, knot them over each other over the front flap until they're flopping on either side of you. Then, pulling the side ends forward and the pointed flap back, you're going to catch the pointed flap by twisting the side ends and pulling them backward, tucking them behind. Simply secure it in the nape of your neck for a snug fit. Lastly, tuck in any poofy parts that create an unnecessary shape. A great turban is only as good as its silhouette. And there you go, that's our first look. Now look number two is a little bit more experimental, but by now many of you know what my style is like. Using the same scarf and triangle formation, we're gonna have the point at the back, and we're gonna tie either side over that point again, pulling it tightly all the way to the nape of the neck. Then moving all of those ends over one shoulder, we're simply going to complete the look by adding a great Panama hat at a tilted angle. And finally, for our third and final look, you will need a long, stretchy, rectangular scarf about one meter wide. And then you're going to put your head right in the center of it with an equal length on either side. Moving along, we're gonna stretch either end outwards, then upwards, and cross them over each other. Once that's done, we're going to tuck in those awkward front bits and create a really nice point that will form the front of our turban. And then, depending on the length of your scarf, we're just going to wrap those remaining ends around your head as many times as they can go and tuck them in where they make sense. I can't give those tucked in ends a set location because as I mentioned, it depends on the length of your scarf and also as we said before, silhouette is everything. Now of course you can rock this turban as is, but what I love to do is to take a sheer long scarf and drape it over my head and toss either end on the opposite shoulder. I think it just gives it a more ethereal, glamorous look and I feel really pretty. And that is it from me for today, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like and subscribe button below. And if you're celebrating Ramadan, I wish you a Ramadan Mubarak. I wish you an Eid Mubarak. And I'll see you next time.